and RJ of Radio Gautam Bayapan and the VJ of FTL Online Television. And the students that you in bachelor fourth year in major English in education. Today, first of all, I would like to thank to Mr. Jambar Kumbhakar and the management of UN College to give me this wonderful opportunity to meet the My friends, when we think about the college, I'm sharing some of my feelings, especially with the newcomers, and it is the great opportunity for me. When we think about the college, we create the images in our mind like a film, a college with full of decoration, with decent teachers, and with so many facilities, you know, so many fashion show, tools, entertaining programs, like that. But are those enough to be a best college? Why? Why the UN Nobotai College is the best college in sector of hotel management in Durham? Because the previous batch of students in UN College were the best. And they the best. the college best in the land. So, hey newcomers, are you ready to break all the records of previous students? Are you ready to make the new and the college best in the land? Keep the, keep the spirit of positive competition and you can do that because in your age, the man has the spirit to conquer the whole world. Are you ready to do that? Yeah! And a man, a man think with the heart. Nothing is impossible. Nothing is impossible. Just we have to keep the positive feelings and positive opinions and compete with ourselves, not with others. So many people compare themselves with others. Oh, Falana is too good. When you go to Sakina, you have a man to lay When you come over Sakina, but don't compare yourself with others. Can you exchange your life with others? No! So why do you compare yourself with others? What happened? What happened if you didn't score in SEE as your wish? Was that the last exam of your life? No! And are you going to say goodbye to the world? No! That was just a step of your life and you have to live at least 50 years in the world, so you will have more steps day by day that were just the letter. So keep yourself always motivated. Dear friends, I would like to uh, let me tell you a story. Once upon a time, a village was deeply uh, suffering with the starvation, and the people of village couldn't go outside because there was so thick forest near the village. There was not any way to go outside. And the animals who were suffering by the starvation, they tried their best to go out from village, but they couldn't. Finally, a donkey, a donkey searched the way between the forest and he went to another village to search the food. And when the people knew that, the people also used that way to go to another village. And after many years, when an engineer came there and uh, uh, he told that he is going to create a new way by cutting the forest, do you know what the people of village said? They said that, no, no, this way was made by our ancestors. So we will go only through this way, a new way can be created. And when, uh, when an old man told the whole story of donkey and said that, Oh no, the way was not made by your ancestors, actually that was made by a donkey. The people became surprised and finally they agreed the engineer's purpose. So I don't have to give you the motivation because you are more fresh than me. You are more younger than me. And the young generation always has more spirit and more energy than others. So you guys are more energetic than me. I don't have to give any motivational speech to you. 
Just, I would like to share some of my experiences with you. Well, uh, one of our teachers, uh, one of our teachers said that always keep positive, always keep positive things, and always compete with yourself. If you have positive feelings, nothing is impossible. When I was in your age, I used to be, you know, I used to be worried about my life. Oh, what will be in my life? What I could do? All that was because my parents and my relatives used to say that You know, I also used to think about that. But slowly, slowly, because of motivation of, of all my friends and the, the seniors like Brahma sir, I realized myself, I realized my quality that I will well speak and I started to speak. I quit just a video in, I quit just a video in Facebook and I started a program in radio and that has lakhs of views today so that I am in front of you to motivate you. And if I, if I am in this situation, can achieve this kind of progress, why don't you guys imagine your ability, realize yourself, and if you realize yourself, nobody can stop you. Keep those hindrances and you go ahead. Just go ahead. Finally, I would like to warmly welcome you in UN Navodaya College because I am also close with UN family and when, uh, when I talked with Mr. Tumbato, uh, the director of UN College and Mr. Gyaneswarja, the chairman of UN College, they are so energetic personality and they always talk about the progress of college. And you, you are so lucky, you are so brilliant that you choose the field that is so scopeful. Thomas has told me once, Ramesh Bhai, I got many, I get many calls every day from Bhedekar, from more tourist areas, um, Tinjure, like those tourist areas, there are so many demands of hotel staff. And uh, uh, we make news always says that Mirchwara doctor bansha, Mirchwara engineer bannu kasa, pilot bannu kasa, wakil bannu kasa. But you guys are being God's man powers. You guys are going to be God's man powers. We will serve all those posts like doctor, engineer, pilot, lawyer. When they will become born with their job, they will come to your hotels to be relaxed. So, love your profession, realize yourself, and enjoy your ability. One day, one day you will break all those historical records of UN College, and UN College will be, again, the best college of Haran, only because of you guys. Thank you.